when someone is going for a pgdm or a mba program okay now that no people have given all these almost all the exam for this season is done okay so and then they have to look for options okay that they have to look on apply to colleges companies and industries are having a lots and lots of data with them yeah and now they know the importance of that data mm-hmm. how they can mine that data and how they can bank on that data so now the importance of data is known to the companies so they rely very much on this data so okay. for mining that data what they need they need someone who is having a good knowledge in this data mining and data analysis and with some of the skills of management also okay, okay. so in that case this program lies with the program this pgdm program that post graduate diploma in management will give you a mix flavor of technology and management which can very well make you stand tall in this competitive field of data analysis and tech. you will be having any experience any specialized degree then only you will be acceptable in you know in, in the selection process okay uh, students normally have this uh, that you no know, course thoda alag hai to humko iske liye kya prepare karna hai okay the how do you go prepared for it okay uh, they have given these entrance exams okay and uh, even if like you no know, because are they going to ask me questions on analytics okay i don't have a background so what should i do okay so so what what ideally is uh, according to you should be a preparation okay required okay. if you Hello everyone and today's interactive video we have with okay Mr Utkar Sharma okay he is the assistant professor in Adani Institute of Digital Technology Management okay and uh, to just to brief okay uh, about his uh, profile okay he uh, he has already done his masters in computer science okay and he is you know right now teaching subjects on big data analytics okay so uh, we are going to interact today about this whole you know thing which is going around is about big data analytics okay you know technology management okay and then there is mba and there is even the top colleges the great colleges are coming up with these courses so uh, firstly uh, welcome sir okay welcome to this session thank you very much mr hader so uh, sir i have i have one question okay because uh, you know like when we talk about these niche profiles okay which is analytics okay and we here okay analytics is the next big thing okay and uh, like almost every company is hiring people in the profile of analytics so uh, when someone is going for a pgdm or a mba program okay now that no people have given all these almost all the exam for this season is done okay so and then they have to look for options okay that they have to look on apply to colleges so obviously adani as a brand itself okay it's a it's a big corporate brand in india okay so uh, definitely people students would look up to okay going for something like this in adani so exactly. what okay, they should expect okay when they are going for this kind of a course okay in big data analytics okay so what exactly is the offering okay so thank you very much for giving me opportunity to talking on this topic so yeah that's a very much interesting field nowadays which we are hearing that big data analytics data analytics data science business analytics there are different names for this single domain that is related to analytics okay there are several application areas of this analytics applications areas are numerous they are not limited to any count or any industry every industry nowadays require analytics even you and me perform analytics for our day to day tasks for example right. suppose example we want to buy something for well, suppose we buy to a t-shirt we'll do an analysis on several platforms we analyze it on flipkart we analyze it on amazon we do a certain kind of analysis then only we go to the correct thing which we want to purchase in the same way companies and industries are having lots and lots of data with them yeah now they know the importance of that data mm-hmm. how they can mine that data and how they can bank on that data so now the importance of data is known to the companies so they rely very much on this data so for in mining that data what they need they need someone who is having a good knowledge in this data mining and data analysis and with some of the skills of management also okay, okay. so in that case this program lies with the program this pgdm program that's post graduate diploma in management will give you a mix flavor of technology and management which can very well make you stand tall in this competitive field of data analysis and technology and all so you will be having both kind of skills the main feature of this program kind of this program which are having technology and management features both that they will not only make you well with the technology along with that they will give you some management skills also so that you can excel in your career 
with some good positions to in future such as managerial position ceo and all okay yeah. so that is the main importance of this program pgdm big data analytics that will give you both management skills and some new age technological skills which are required to be future ready in this job market so so um, now next thing comes up okay when when we talk about because it is it is a tech driven role okay so it's, it's a techno managerial role okay in a program that you're talking about so students coming from non technical background okay like you no know, bcom bca okay you know, any of the non technical background jinhone nahi padha hai sab you know yes, yes. they're not well versed with computer science and all that okay for them okay uh, how challenging okay or you know it, this transition okay from a non tech to a techno managerial kind of a program how uh, how challenging it is going to be for them because they are going to be confused with this ki ye karu ki nahi karu because mera to technical background nahi hai exactly yeah so that is the question which i got to hear uh, once or twice daily from the student <laughs> from each and every branch so let me tell you one thing this program is pgdm program right this is a management related degree in the technical field so the if we are talking about the engineering student so when engineering students enters in a program so that student does not have any managerial related knowledge hmm that those will be the subjects which will be teaching in this course yeah. so for them the management skills are zero they will be learning that from the scratch yes. and there will be some students which are from bba background so yeah. for them the basics of management are clear but their technological knowledge will be at base yes yes okay. yes there will be some students they are from bcom background so for them statistical skills are good that's very all required for this type of course analytical skills they will be having statistical knowledge but they will not be having programming knowledge and management knowledge yes. so for them both those things will be new yeah so we cannot design this kind of program which requires some prerequisite learning from the students Yeah, because for an engineering students we have to teach management from the basics. Yeah, for a management students we have to teach the technical knowledge from the basics. Yes, and yes. for a BCom, BA, and BB, for other any BSc background students we have to teach both from the basics. Yes, yes, right. So each and every subject in this program starts from the scratch. We do not can have that perception in our mind that our students will be having any prerequisite knowledge. Yes, and what happens here in our institute precisely that we conduct a bridge course session of month long prior to induction in the course, in which they the students which are from different background will be having a flavor that what will be there, Achha. they can be part at the same level prior to running of the course. Okay, so if you can just brief about this bridge course, okay, exactly. So what kind of things are covered there? Exactly. For example, if there are some programming languages to be taught in this course okay so if suppose a person who had never seen a programming language and never heard of a programming language so for that directly teaching a programming language is last like a, a bad dream come true okay so for them this session is like that what are exactly program is okay yes. those who had not even seen a program once in a life never had a uh, chance of coding one or two lines even so in this particular bridge course session they will be given the basics flavor that why you we need program and how we uh, perform the basic programming skills not only for program such a person engineer background students also they do not uh, have the statistics or mathematical skills very well when they graduate from the course okay yes, so yes. for them also we will be teaching the basic of statistics in this bridge course there will be a module which will giving in the basic statistical measures such as mean median mode what are the number theory whole number even odd everything from the basics will be given in this bridge course yes yes okay okay great i think that that uh, and i i happened to speak to some of the students okay of uh, aidtm and uh, one of the students told me that sir i am currently interning okay with one of the analytics firm okay and my other students okay who got into a general management program okay in some other college probably okay so they are also doing internship in analytics only but the thing is i got trained okay in my first year okay on all these different subjects of analytics so i know what to do now and wahan pe you know unko bol diya ki aap hi tool sikho aap hi sab kuch sikho yeah. and go to the internship okay there that's so uh 
एंड बट मतलब इन जनरल पीपल नॉर्मली सी दैट कि अच्छा हम अगर नॉर्मल एम करते हैं तो हमको थोड़ा एडवांटेज मिलेगा हम नीच नहीं करना चाहते सो इफ वी कंपेयर दीज टू काइंड ऑफ प्रोग्राम ओके विच इज अ जनरल एम बी ए प्रोग्राम ओके वीजा विजा एम बी ओके और पी जी डी एम इन बिग डेट एन आर एटेक समथिंग लाइक दैट ओके सो हाउ शुड वी कंपेयर इवन दीज टू प्रोग्राम्स सी थिंग इज दैट कि दैट द नी द प्लेन एम बी ए प्रोग्राम्स विल बी अ matter of just future of past after few days okay yeah, yeah. because the thing is that people are graduating in with this management degrees having expertise in some additional domain perfect okay. they are also learning the management skills which are given in management mba hr mba finance mba other fields yes okay but they are experienced they are specialized in a particular domain so they need not to given some other other uh, knowledge okay suppose a person is going to be a manager of a firm that particular firm deals totally in big data yeah so how a person having from an o core mba degree how mm. that that can person understand the business properly yes that can only apply the management skills there okay that that person might be well there but a person who is having knowledge of big data and technology has outs work and that person goes to a firm having a managerial position although he is not going any manager any technical related work there he mm-hmm. wants to just take only managerial decision but a person who knows the business well can perform well yeah so that will be the thing in future that you will be having any experience any specialized degree then only you will be acceptable in the market yeah so so i i see that because a lot of students okay uh, have started doing separate courses like along with mba okay where they are getting yeah, yeah. on these things exactly yes. and in Let fact we talk about example yeah. uh, hr is a field right now okay mba hr is a field nowadays we have hrs already but there are so many tools available nowadays which can do the work of hrs very easily Yes. Okay. They will not be replacing the HR, but they will be assisting the HR of a company. Perfect. Okay? Yes. And in our course, we have a separate module named HR Analytics. That yes. will be a course related to what are the analytics required for a HR domain. Yes. So that person will be having HR skills already, but along with that, some analytical skills. Ha uh-huh. ha ha. so uh, so towards the end okay because uh, you know in in the selection process okay uh, students normally have this uh, that you know course thoda alag hai to humko iske liye kya prepare karna chahiye okay the how do you go prepared for it okay uh, they have given these entrance exams okay and uh, even if like you know because are they going to ask me questions on analytics okay i don't have a background so what should i do okay so so what what ideally is uh, according to you should be a preparation okay required to be process something like that so as i already told that we do not require any prerequisite of this field from the students that's that's the main thing that's why they will be learning otherwise they will be having that knowledge while they will be going for this course so we can't expect that they already should know each and everything of this course but still a learning acumen should be there in that person and a basic understanding that what data is doing around us okay what there is any importance of data around us or not or they should be having a basic quantitative skills on basic aptitude skills that's all is required from them side okay okay the rest is on us we will just train them well in the two next the two years whatever it will they, they will be here they should have their learning acumen wide so that will help them a lot and for the uh, requirements basically they should be having a graduation in any discipline okay. with a minimum 50% score okay and they should be appeared they might have appeared in any of the entrance exam listed by ic aict such as cat mat zat cmat gmat or atma okay so that's the only requirements of the atma exam happening the month of may so even that is accepted by yeah, yeah sure why not okay okay we Perfect. can wait for that yeah yeah, yeah. So after the these two criteria is fulfilled they will be going for an cohort uh, assessment profile an exam Mm-hmm. that's a very basic to judge the quantitative skills again nothing else mm-hmm. their thinking ability that's all and mm-hmm. after that they will be going through a pi round that is personal interview round with the faculties of this institute so they will we will just judge their uh, handling of or just knowing of the data or what the awareness about data that person is having about yeah yeah 
great i think that that uh, you know give, gives students the insight okay that they should not be burdened up with uh, you know learning things about what is analytics you can all that okay but i think basic you know uh, quantitative skills so can these entrance exams okay can also help them yes, okay. yes. yeah yeah so thanks a lot sir okay i think uh, you know this this clears a lot of doubts okay of what they should expect okay and definitely uh in today's world okay there is nothing that happens without analytics okay so this is going to be a great uh, you know future okay for the students to have thanks a lot sir thank you very much sir thank you very much